And I was, you know, Richard Rogers' daughter, brought up by my father, who said most people in the world get up every day bored to death with what they're about to go off and have to do to make a living. And I get up every day and look forward to what I'm going to be doing. And what I was thinking about was, there must be something I love to do. And I adored the theater. I thought, I have to find something to do in the theater. So that summer, I was an apprentice at the Westport Playhouse. It's the same year Steve was, which was how we became such good friends. We were both assistant stage managers and, uh, you know, apprentices. We'd go out and look for props and then from the age of about 21, when I first started to, to write children's songs, I figured I could sneak in the back door and nobody would notice, nor did they, of course, until Marshall and I wrote Once Upon a Mattress. So we auditioned Once Upon a Mattress, which was then called The Princess and the Pea, for uh, George Abbott, who said, listen, I think it's swell, I like it very much, but uh, I only have till May and you'll never have enough time to get it done by May, so if you can get it done by May, I have May free and I'll direct it. Uh, so we got it done.